Hey, ladies and gentlemen, what's up? It's Papa Bail. Welcome to the channel. Okay, so you see that's just under half a volt. I'm pretty sure we're pushing like on um, reality and in reality about 200 milliamps, but the speed of this thing <laughs> is just chewing it up. Look at that. How fast that's going for half a volt, man. That's crazy. Awesome, though. I mean, it's crazy awesome. It's not like a bad thing, you know? It's. It has a lot to do with this switch that I'm using. And the coil underneath. It's another 16 gauge, 250 turn uh, coil. That's just, wow, I'm so excited about that, man. I'm so happy that that's working the way it is. And you can tell that it's working because it's going up. As to where the switch is, it's not going down, it's going up. <laughs> that's awesome. Here, let me just give it a little bit of juice and we'll see what it's really all about here. This is 1.5 volts. Well, 1.3 Anyway, I think that's really cool. I mean, I don't I don't know how much like quote unquote power this thing has got but I know that it'll it'll work at under half a volt. <laughs> I'm happy about that. And now what I'm see what I'm doing is I'm getting the rotor with the bigger magnets, the nine magnet rotor that I was using before. I'm gonna put it back in that that slot right there. I'm gonna see if that one can't generate enough electricity to run both of these. Alright, well, that's it. That's all I got. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, I think it's very significant, the fact that these can run on such little energy. And I purposefully put it up to a point where it's drawing at least 100 milliamps. Just now, like 1.3 volts. It's drawing 1.1.2 milliamps just look at that man that's freaking cool dude I'm just like blown away just looking at it knowing that there's not even enough energy in here to turn on a Hall effect sensor and look at it That's, that's freaking awesome. All right. Bye now.